I am so excited to be married just because I'm marrying Elliot. Welcome to Ms. Mojo. And today we're counting down our picks for the top 10 most beautiful celebrity weddings. And I don't have to cover anything else, Sherry, no. For this list, we're looking at the most photogenic celebrity nuptials that look like they're straight out of a fairy tale. Which celeb wedding would you make your mood board? Let us know in the comments. Number 10, Paris Hilton and Carter Ream. The businesswoman, socialite, and OG influencer shared that her favorite time of day is 11-11 because it reminds her to, quote, make a wish and be open to miracles. 11-11 is an indicator of a new beginning. It's a harbinger of a new opportunity in front of you. And it's the perfect moment to turn the page and start a new chapter in your life. Indeed, her wedding was something of a wish come true. She and her now husband Carter Ream fulfilled her dream to tie the knot at her grandfather's former estate on November 11th, 1111 in 2021. You have just changed my life in every way. Hilton stunned in an Oscar de la Renta gown, but of course, that wasn't her only show-stopping outfit that night. The couple pulled out all the stops to create an extravagant and chic fairy tale. Plus, a wedding that serves fries? Put us on the guest list pronto. Number 9. Sofia Vergara and Joe Manganiello The modern family actress once told Ellen DeGeneres that she thought Joe Manganiello was, quote, too handsome to date. It was like a, like a, a fairy tale. Yeah. Like it came out perfectly like how I wanted, I have to say. Well, she bravely overlooked that, and the pair went on to say their I do's, or I wills, in 2015. They married at the Breakers in Palm Beach, adorned by a lavish floral display. Wearing a breathtaking Zuhair Murad couture dress, Vergara was escorted down the aisle by her son and joined Maganello, who looked dapper in a John Barbados tuxedo. The duo shared their first dance to Sinatra's The Way You Look Tonight. And based on all the photos the couple shared, we are totally in love with how everything looked that night. Yeah. You missed a very good part. I did. <laughs> Number 8. Neil Patrick Harris and David Burtka This couple is typically quite open about their personal lives, but their nuptials were relatively private. The duo wed in Perugia, Italy in 2014, surrounded by their nearest and dearest. It was a, like a lot of uh, wonderful chaos, but it was mostly an amazing time for everyone that was there. According to Kelly Ripa, who was among the guests, Harris incorporated his love of magic tricks into the festivities, and their good friend Sir Elton John performed too. Did Elton John sing at your wedding? He did, he sang three songs. No, yeah. what did he sing? Um, he sang uh, Can You Feel the Love Tonight and, um, I can't remember. Were you there? Okay. Yeah, I wow. was there. The couple's then three-year-old twins were also part of the wedding party, and apparently their son Gideon was meant to act as the ring bearer. But Rippa shared that instead, he chose to hand out oranges to guests as he made his way down the aisle. And later on during the night we were dancing, I said to him, look, Look, uh, Gideon, I saved your orange because I'm going to keep it forever. And he goes, oh, you shouldn't. It's so delicious. <laughs> <laughs> it is not conventional, but it's certainly memorable. Needless to say, it was a unique and magical occasion. Number 7. Solange Knowles and Alan Ferguson Solange and music video director Alan Ferguson wed at the Marini Opera House in New Orleans in 2014. Solange told Vogue that the wedding was, quote, a labor of love. The couple's big day featured a few unconventional details, including their grand entrance on matching vintage white bicycles and inviting all the attendees to wear white. Still, Solange no doubt made heads turn with three gorgeous outfits, our favorite of which has to be the dress and cape designed by Umberto Leon for Kenzo. The photos of the couple and their families in the church are absolutely stunning, and their reception looks like a lot of fun. Mother and son also shared a sweet moment at the reception, busting some serious moves to no flex zone. In one shot, guests can be seen quite literally celebrating the sparks between the newlyweds. Talk about a picture-perfect event. The vows, they were the most beautiful thing there was in the dry eye in the, in the uh, place. Number six, Sierra and Russell Wilson. Sierra stands know that she's a queen. And I take you as you are, with your heart in weathered hands. So what better venue for music royalty than a 19th century castle in Cheshire, England? 
The pair initially planned to tie the knot in North Carolina, but reportedly changed their minds due to the state's transphobic bathroom bill. Instead, they celebrated their love with a wedding that wouldn't look out of place in a Disney movie or romantic period flick. Baby, when you take my head, you show me that my scars are beautiful. Sierra really looked the part in her custom Roberto Cavalli dress, while her new hubby embodied Prince Charming in a handcrafted Giorgio Armani suit. It might not have been the wedding they initially planned, but we think it's fair to say they leveled up. You show me that my scars are beauty marks. Number 5. Nick Jonas and Priyanka Chopra This power couple arguably had the wedding event of 2020. Nick and Priyanka got married in Rajasthan, India because India is very near and dear to Priyanka's heart, and they wanted all of their family and friends to be able to attend. After all, it was a three-day do. The duo began with a stunning Haldi ceremony. At the Sangeet, the families lovingly competed with performances celebrating the bride and groom and their respective careers. The marriage ceremonies intertwined Christian and Hindu traditions, and Jonas's dad even officiated. Also, can we just take a second to acknowledge that they got married at the Umad Bhavan Palace? Yeah, that's right, an actual palace. The venue for the event was this grand palace in Rajasthan that housed numerous ceremonies and events throughout the weekend. Indeed, Priyanka's Sabiasachi Lahenga and Ralph Lauren outfits deserve to be displayed in such grandeur. It really looked like an idyllic celebration. What do you mean it's usually a thousand? Why wasn't it a thousand then? Because I think we just wanted to keep it super intimate about just family. Super intimate, audience. just 200 people. <laughs> For an Indian family and an Indian wedding, for sure. Number 4. Sophia Ritchie and Elliot Grange In April 2023, the model and media personality married music executive Elliot Grange in southern France. Many labeled the celebration as quiet luxury. That is, if you consider quiet taking place at the historic Hôtel du Cap et Roc, with Richie in a custom-made Chanel gown, among other outfits, mostly A-list invitees, and Vogue having exclusive rights to the photos. It was like larger than life, a dream to have a Chanel wedding dress. The bride looked like a princess, and there's no denying that their chosen venue is incredibly picturesque. Sophia, whose dad is Lionel Richie, shared a few sneak peeks at the actual wedding day on Instagram, including an epic fireworks show. Plus, did you see the entertainment? Well, what do you expect? Expect when the bride's father is Lionel Richie. Number 3. Lily Collins and Charlie McDowell Do weddings get any more fairy tale than this? If numerous reports hadn't informed us that the couple wed at the Dunton Hot Springs Resort in Colorado, we would have thought they stumbled across an actual enchanted forest. Isn't it beautiful? It's it like is. an old abandoned ghost town, mining town made into a hotel. Nothing more romantic than a, a ghost town to get married in. Everything about the celebration looks so quaint, rustic, and magical that they could have easily lifted it straight out of a storybook. Even Colin's gorgeous floral lace dress by Ralph Lauren beautifully complemented the theme. It was, it was a whimsical, beautiful dress, and I love it. We have no doubt that their photos, especially the ones in front of the waterfall, have found their way to countless wedding mood boards. As Charlie says on Instagram, I've married the most generous, thoughtful, and beautiful person I've ever known. I love you. Number 2. John Legend and Chrissy Teigen Lake Como is among Europe's most beautiful locations. So is it any surprise that it's a popular choice for weddings? What would I do without your smart mouth? The landscape serves as an idyllic backdrop. Needless to say, this couple made the most of it. The pair tied the knot at a villa where they would often vacation. Love your curves and all your edges, all your perfect imperfections. Tegan revealed that she anxiously bought five dresses for her big day and ended up wearing three, all Vera Wang. The ceremony itself was pushed back by several hours since a storm delayed the groom's family's arrival. Still, when you see the photos and how happy they look, you just know it was worth the wait. I give you all of me. Before we unveil our top pick, here are some honorable mentions. Miranda Kerr and Evan Spiegel. Well, there's no way the flower girl ran out of petals. We really complement each other, you know? It's just so nice to have a partner that like brings out the best in you and you bring out the best in them. Ellen DeGeneres and Portia de Rossi. A stunning, intimate occasion at the couple's home. You are the one I've been waiting for today. 
Dwayne The Rock Johnson and Lauren Hashian. A picturesque Hawaiian wedding at the crack of dawn. Just imagine that sunrise. Thank you for this life you've already given us. I'm so ready to say I do. Hey, <laughs> <laughs> so good. Samira Wiley and Lauren Morelli. The happy couple brought the fun to their Funfetti-themed wedding. Uh, I mean, I think that's the one thing that we wanted so much. We wanted it to be fun, hence the Funfetti theme the fun of the wedding. Yeah. George Clooney and Amal Alamuddin. This power couple declared their amore along the Grand Canal in Venice. George and Amal decided to just make this a big family affair. The friends yeah. were there, a big, big friend. Before we continue, be sure to subscribe to our channel and ring the bell to get notified about our latest videos. You have the option to be notified for occasional videos or all of them. If you're on your phone, make sure you go into your settings and switch on notifications. Number one, Kim Kardashian and Kanye West. Just as we thought nothing could be as extravagantly over the top as Kim's wedding to Chris Humphreys, she said, hold my bouquet. Yeah, the reality star Kim Kardashian tying the knot with superstar Kanye West over the weekend in Italy in spectacular fashion. Kim and Ye exchanged vows at the Forte di Belvedere in Florence, Italy in 2014. The venue, located on a hilltop, is renowned for its scenic views of the city. In addition to family and friends, Kim Ye's wedding party also included a baby Northwest. The villa itself oozes elegance, but is still flashy enough to suit this couple perfectly. Also, the flower backdrop is exactly the kind of swanky aesthetic we'd expect from a Kardashian event. Party goers like Common, Jaden Smith, Rachel Roy, and Lala Anthony enjoying an Italian feast of pasta, fish, and steak, rosé, and gold champagne. As Kim always does, she looked beautiful in her Givenchy dress. Is it any wonder her Instagram picture from the big day broke the record for the most likes? Do you agree with our picks? Check out this other recent clip from Ms. Mojo. And be sure to subscribe and ring the bell to be notified about our latest videos.